Okay, here's a brief look at the Bedini lid motor, I call it, and uh, what it is. It's a uh, permanent magnet motor with a lid off of a honey jar with neo magnets placed inside the lid. And then it uh, it's running with the nickel metal hydride batteries that um, are about 10 volts. And the permanent magnet motor is in series with a little coil and a bridge rectifier. It puts out about one and a half to two volts here that uh, when it's revved up to the right point will charge this little battery. Now it's also worked in a circuit to this potentiometer here with a switch at the bottom of it that I can depress this switch and rev the motor up. And that goes into a little higher resonance if I have this set up just right. And the way the motor is, was made was um, I wanted to make a generator out of it. So what I did was I, I found a uh, permanent magnet motor that was mounted inside uh, this mini fan here. And it's just a little handheld mini fan, and uh, it worked perfect for what I wanted to do. It has a little permanent magnet motor in it, and I wired that in a circuitry. Um, by the way, you can find all the circuitry for this uh, on YouTube. Um, punch up Bedini motor and uh, invertebrate, intervertebrate, <laughs> and KT Services and Ray of Energy, and a bunch of other guys have great literature on how to build one of these Bedini motors and the circuits. But anyway, the, the, my motor is using a lid off of a honey jar. And the lid had little slots in it where I could place these little neo magnets in the slots of the lid and attach them in there. And then attach the hub inside there and then put that onto the motor. And now I've got uh, a generator, built-in generator. And the way it works is when you energize this, of course, it spins up. But when you stop energizing, that spinning puts juice back into the system. And that's what I wanted to do, was uh, make a simplified generator out of the Bedini motor. And that's the, uh, the situation here. Now, let me put this on again. I'll show you what I like about this is if you give this a little deal and energize it, this spins right up to the residence you want it to go at. And it'll stay there, and of course it's putting out juice right now, energizing that battery. Anyway, that's the little lid motor project. Um, I do recommend doing it. It works quite well. All the information's on the internet, on the circuitry. Uh, just when you wire this up, put this in series, and uh, put it into here. And you made yourself a little generator using the Bedini motor.